Everybody and welcome to American Idol Reboot Edition 2026. I'm Ryan Seacrest, your host. Still looking exactly the same as I did in 2006. <laughs> America, it's the moment you've been waiting for. There's been a lot of blood, sweat, and tears leading up to tonight, but now America will make a choice. Who will your next idol be? Aside from President Trump Jr., hail to the chief. Applause, people! Reboot edition be without our brilliant judges. Please give a warm Hollywood welcome to Paula Abdul and Simon Cowell. They can get over their differences to perform this hefty duet? Ryan, baby, I'm gonna level with you too. These two ladies in this competition have been pretty hot and heavy. <laughs> well, since the Trumptonian monarchy declared that no women above a size two can be within 50 feet of a television camera, this is the shit show we're stuck. I'll drink that. Let's get this shit started. Please welcome your two finalists, all the way from Albuquerque, New Mexico, Sharpay Evans and Kelsey Nielsen! <laughs> this break. 
break. <laughs> Remember back in the dark ages of 2016 when dangers lurked around every corner? Free birth control? <gasps> gay marriage? <gasps> basic human rights? <laughs> oh, well, <laughs> the Trumptonian monarchy is now and forever will be here to stay. We at Trumptonian Monarchy Incorporated just wanted to remind you Nothing's changed, or ever will. So sit back, bask in America's greatness again, and enjoy the show. What the hell was that? Uh, just a PSA reminding England how bad 2016 could have been. Are you ready, ladies? Of course, but I don't know if this bozo in the hat is. Sharpay, <laughs> you're really trying to write anxiety. <laughs> Are you ready? Where's the music? Trumptonian law deemed instrumental music last week as extraneous joy will no longer be tolerated. <laughs> Ladies, it's time to start singing! <laughs> How does my song go? Bop to the top. You don't know how bop to the top. What are the first words? You believe in dreaming oh. and you <laughs> for the stars! <laughs> Dream it and shoot for the stars. Oh my god! Baby, to be oh, number god. one, you have to raise the bars. Oh. Kicking and scratching, grinding up my bed. Anything it takes to climb the ladder of success. Hold <laughs> oh, 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 the bloody bone. Ladies, what was that? Sharpay, you sounded like a cow in labor. Worse than that, a cow in labor with quadruplets. <laughs> what happened out there? I. <clears throat> I may have smoked a cigarette before the show. Or 12. Amen. Anything to bring back my fabulousness? <laughs> Excuse me, what? Uh, nothing. No, no, Sharpe. Uh, Kelsey has a point. Last week, I saw a cat get run over by a garbage truck, and that cat's wail sounded much better than you. This morning, on my way to work, I saw a plastic bag drifting through the wind, and that plastic bag had a better dance moves than you. I could go on, but I won't. This is not what I want! This is not what I planned! <laughs> Nobody liked you in high school! Not even Brian, he told me! <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I just wanted to say that. I don't think. So, Simon, what do you want to do now? <laughs> <laughs> well, America, the votes are in, and let me tell you, this is a first. It seems Kelsey has won the popular vote, but Sharpay has won the electoral college. <laughs> Since Sharpay has left the stage, it seems that Kelsey Nielsen, you are the next American Idol! And with that, we conclude the first and final season of American Idol Reboot Edition. Nothing was wrong with it. Donald Trump Jr. just threw a tantrum when he saw it had higher ratings than Celebrity Apprentice. <laughs> Goodbye and good night, America!